again. And yeah. Anyway, we tried to film this video yesterday, but it didn't work out. My mom is here, that's why. And it was her birthday yesterday. Happy birthday. Thank you. Happy late birthday. Um, what? Oh yeah, before I get to the video, the subject is, are you, I feel like I'm on the side. Anyway, it's like, any, <laughs> the subject is, I'm gonna talk about parade and under the cherry moon, because yeah. And before I get into that, of course, I have two, not one, but two new additions to the Prince final because I'm silly. And one of them has to do with parade. So, but the first one, I'll get out of the way because it has nothing to do with it, uh, is the single for I Wish You Heaven. And it looks like that. Is it in? A little on the back. And of course, the B side is one of my favorite Prince songs. But I won't say the name. It's, it's kind of racy. Anyway, um, you just look it up. I wish you have and then you'll the B side, whatever. And the actual, uh, the, the actual other one, <laughs> the other one is a single for Another Lover with a Hole in Your Head, the extended, because I have, and it was like $2. And this is on parade, so yeah, it looks like that. And on the back it has brown mark, I believe. He put, that's like the subject of like each parade single like you put somebody else on the back from the revolution and yeah there's like a bump you see that Ooh. you know what else both of these say um it says lend for promotional use only any sale or unauthorized transfer is prohibited and void subject well you know what, what does that mean do you know what that means isn't that kind of weird? But they sold it to you. Yeah. In a, in a store. Anyway, um, <laughs> uh, the actual subject is parade. And should I talk about the movie or the CD first? I'll talk about the CD. And seriously, this took me five. What was that? Do I need to fix something. <laughs> <laughs> Straight enough. Um, what? Oh, yeah. This took me like five months to grow on me because I got it in January and it's always it's not like I dislike the album it's always been a and eh, I've always been like wait do we have an audience member? like seriously I've always been like eh, like I've only really like Kiss and I Wonder You and that's it the rest I was like eh, whatever and sometimes it starts in April of course but then, recently, out of nowhere, when I listened to it, I was like, oh my god, this is really freaking good. And now I like all the songs. It used to be like a skipped album. I used to be like, eh, whatever. And mom, we were listening to it in the car earlier. You know, boys and girls. That was so <laughs> not how it goes. You know, it's called Boys and Girls. And now that is like my second favorite song on here. And you know what? It's the B side to this. Is that a happy song? And I noticed that has the same uh, instrument that sounds like a, people say it sounds like a duck or whatever. And it has the same instrument as in the song uh, Sexual Suicide, which is supposed to be on Dream Factory, but then blah, 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 whatever. But yeah, and it was during that time. So, and it just had, some songs have like a, like the same theme, like uh, the first song and like Do You Lie? You know, like it sounds very, I don't know, it sounds like older. It doesn't sound 80s at all. And then, like another lover holding your head and kiss, or like more pop 80s. And it's all very happy. What was I gonna say? Oh yeah, and my friend Daryl pointed out, I'm not gonna like say something and like not give somebody credit, but my friend Daryl pointed out that the cover is just by, like him by himself, even though he said that uh, Prince had like the least input on this one in particular, like because of the orchestra and like Wendy and Lisa wrote some songs, but then it's just him on the cover. So, but then on the, on the vinyl, <laughs> yeah, you have to smile to give you motivation. Not like, what is this girl talking about? Um, I feel like I was gonna say something else. Well, about the movie, I guess. Actually, I noticed um, uh, a lot of the lyrics go along with the movie. 
it's like I don't know. <laughs> no, not all of it, but whatever. The movie itself is very like quirky and like like you have to like a certain like it like what's it called like a B movie. You do you can't like go and watch it and be like this better be Oscar winning or whatever. Is it getting dark? No. Really? Fine, so it's fine. like dark. Anyway. What was it? Oh yeah. And you, uh, did, haven't you seen it? You, you were watching, it was like in the background and you guys were like, what is this? So it's just a very silly movie, but it's still really good. And the thing is like, if you're already a Prince fan, it's fun uh, seeing him in like funny situations and stuff like that, seeing him run around and like, uh, oh yeah. I don't know, just seeing him act silly and like, some parts is like just really bad acting <laughs> and my brother was like prince needs to this is his word stay in his element <laughs> he was just like no and he actually directed this did you know that's it and then of course i still haven't seen graffiti bridge but he wrote and directed that one and i haven't seen it but yeah i feel like i'm missing something this whole thing was like in a continuous Thing. If you're wondering, I doubt it, but if you're wondering what my favorite songs are, they would definitely be I Wonder You and Girls and Boys are like my top two. Peace. And sometimes it snows in April and Another Lover and Christopher Chase's Parade. The whole thing, really. Do you hear that dog? It's in the car. I got the Hermanji. <laughs> Man, I was just gonna say something. Oh yeah, particularly um, another lover hole in your head. Um, that was like my least favorite. Can you believe that was like my least favorite? I've always been like, eh, whatever, out of the whole album. And now it's like one of my favorites, which is why I got the single for it. And I recently heard the extended. Really good. And the music video. Remember the music video I showed you because Susanna was in it and I was like, oh, that's the girl that Prince was dating and these songs are about her and apparently If I Was Your Girlfriend is about her and Wendy and Lisa and all that. Yeah. I love that video. <laughs> do, do, do. Wasn't that cool what they were doing? Like, that was like a dance. Was it like this? I don't even remember. I've watched it so many times now. I just recently watched it because I didn't know, I was only watching like the KISS video and I'm just now, what? Like that? I'm getting a light, uh -huh, there, uh-huh. What was I saying? She was really pretty. She, I thought she would be identical to, uh, Lindy. I always like, say the wrong name. But like, she's like, different. You said she's prettier than her sister. I was like, uh. <laughs> Can you see how long it's been? Two minutes. That's it? Oh, plus the other thing. Okay, well, I think that's about it for now. Uh, you can let me know what you think of it. And, yeah, and what you think of the movie, and all that stuff, and what your favorite songs are, and any other requests, you can leave it there. Oh, and I know I said I just posted that question, like, ask me a question video, but the next video will be answering those, if I get more than two. So yeah. Uh, okay. Well, you guys have a good night.